Hello children. In the previous session, we had learned describing words, right? And we have solved a few exercises from our textbook. Today, we are going to solve the remaining exercises. So children, I want all of you to open your grammar textbook. To page number 22. All will open your grammar textbook to page number 22. Okay, question E. All will keep your finger on the book and repeat after me. Okay. Read this passage. Then complete the words using the describing words from the passage. Okay, now see here. Babita loses her blue purse in the big park. So now here see children in this sentence purse. How is the purse? Purse is blue. Purse is the noun. And blue is the adjective. Okay. Now here park. Park is the noun. Naming word. And how is the park? Park is big. Big is the adjective. Okay. She asks a young girl... To help her find it. Now see here. Girl. Girl is a naming word. And how is this girl? Girl is young. Young is the adjective. Okay. Now. The young girl looks under the yellow bench. Now young girl we have already done here. Now see here. Bench. Bench is the naming word. And how is the bench? What is the color of the bench? Bench is yellow. So it is the adjective. Where Babita sits. Then she looks behind a tall tree. Now tree is the naming word. And how is this tree? Tree is tall. Tall is the adjective. She even looks inside a dirty dustbin. Now see dustbin is the naming word and dirty it is the what? Adjective describes. Finally she finds it near the two flower pots. With pink roses. Okay. Now see flower pots. This is the naming word. How many flower pots are there? Two. Two is the adjective. With the pink roses. Pink. Uh, sorry. Roses. Roses is the naming word. Rose. And how are the roses? Roses are pink. Pink is the adjective. Babita is very happy. Okay, now you can see Babita. When she finds her purse, she is very happy. Thank you, she says to the young girl. Then Babita, she thanks the young girl for finding her purse. Okay, children. Now, here they have given you a few examples, nouns. Okay, now you have to see in the passage and write the describing words for these nouns. Okay, now see here. The first one is done for you. Dash purse. A blue purse. Pur blue is the adjective. So, they have written here. This example is solved. The second one. Dash park. You can see here. What is the park? How is it? It is big. So we write here big park. B-I-G. Big park. Third one. Dash girl. See how is the girl here? Girl is young. 
so you write here young y o u n g young fourth dash bench see bench what is the bench here what color is it yellow y e l l o w yellow bench dash tree see the tree how it is tall so tall tree t a l l tall tree t a l l tall tree dash dustbin how is the dustbin we have read in the passage dustbin is dirty d i r t y dirty dustbin seventh dash flower pots how many are there two so t w o two flower pots and the eighth one dash roses so how are the roses here roses are pink p i n k pink okay children now the next exercise c f1 write two describing words for each picture okay now you can see here they have given you a picture and they have told you to write two describing words one example they have already given you okay the next example you have to write describing words you may write of your own children no need to write what the teacher is giving you okay you can write your own describing words what you feel about that object you can describe like that is it clear now first example is given juicy watermelon now one more adjective what you can write big watermelon green watermelon cd watermelon okay anything that describes so we'll write here green g r e e n green watermelon big watermelon or uh, cd watermelon okay now the next second one teddy bear see the teddy bear how it is pink and white teddy bear teddy bears are soft s o f t soft teddy bear cute teddy bear cute teddy bear big teddy bear small teddy bear okay any adjective you can write now a flower here flower red flower beautiful flower big flower small flower sweet smelling flower okay any adjective you can write now next mango raw mango ripe mango raw means which is green color okay and it is not juicy but the ripe mangoes are juicy and they are sweet and raw mangoes they are sour in taste and ripe mangoes are sweet in taste okay so now see this mango it is not green it is not yellow like that okay the ripe mangoes they are little bit yellowish orangish color but ripe mangoes are green in color so you can write juicy ma uh, juicy mango sour mango sweet mango okay sweet mango or you can write green mango yellow mango ripe mango okay now the fifth one your favorite dish i hope everybody likes this ice cream right so ice creams are cold cold ice cream yummy ice cream y u w m y yummy ice cream delicious ice cream okay you can write your own adjectives okay now children 
this is all for today and for your homework what you are going to do is you are going to draw five objects of your own any object you can draw okay and you have to write two describing words for each object okay you draw the object color the object and give two describing words for each object is it clear children so this will be your homework okay we are going to stop here for today and continue in the next session thank you children